so my brain's finally functioning again, uh, slowly but surely. Uh, I decided to write down some things because then that way I think we stay on track. Um, yeah, so I was talking to a lovely lady on Twitter the other day and we were talking about uh, a film called The Road, which is actually also a book. And she was reading the book and I was watching the film. Just don't bother. It's just awful. It's the most depressing thing ever. I don't know why they made it. I don't know who wrote it, but they've obviously had some really awful experiences in life and just want us all to be bitter and depressed with them. Just don't do it. That's what I say. Um, but also, it got us on talking about From Gem With Love. She's got a book club. Um, I don't know if she's still accepting people into it but um if you do want to find out about it then go to her site i think it's a fantastic idea it's great for bloggers because obviously you know it brings people together um i think they do book reviews and stuff like that i, I don't know i'm i'm dyslexic so if i was to join it you'd get like a review in say 10 years i'm just so slow at reading but it's not you know, I'm not going to deny you from joining, so I think it's a great idea, so yeah, go check it out, I will leave the link in the lower bar, um, also some things I want to try, um, I might need your advice on fake tan, see this is me, Pelnis, and I want to look more like, oh, oh I should have planned and picked an image of a golden looking goddess but now I can't find one <laughs> well basically I just I want to look tan but not orange um yeah so if you've got any recommendations I've had a few but sometimes I think a good way is when a few people suggest the same thing because then you know that you're onto a winner whereas if you get odds and ends of recommendations it can be a bit like oh should I splash the money um I know saint is good oh saint sorry saint saint um and I think there's a spray tan booth thing near near where we live so um I might try that I don't know but I want to try it at home I don't know I, I get really embarrassed I don't really want someone spraying my wobbly bits um to look, to look more tanned <laughs> I'd rather just you know don the mitt and do it myself but yeah last time I did fake tan was so many years ago and I think someone actually thought I had a rash and was ill and yeah and thought they'd come over and you know check how I was doing so I think that probably counts as a, tell, a tan, tan fell so yeah but yeah if you can help me out I'd really appreciate it uh, also I'm doing a new feature on my blog called Starfall um, I've got the next one set up but I still need suggestions so please if there's any celebrity look or any film look that you'd like to see like I did 500 days of summer I did summer's look so um, you can go check that out on my blog but yeah please anything it can it can be a bit silly it can be a bit crazy or it you know it can be that celebrity that you absolutely adore um obviously it's my spin on it um so but I think people have enjoyed the ones I've done so far um I've done Kirsten Dunst as well um and the next one is gonna be actually I won't tell you what the next one's gonna be I'm gonna keep it a secret you have to wait and see but yeah if you leave comments either here or on my blog um and just let me know what you want to see because you know it's it's no fun it's no fun when I have to do it all it's not it's nice if you say look this is what I need this is what I need but yeah so um also I was talking to I think it was who's I talking to I can't even remember. I'm sorry, my brain, my brain, my poor brain. It's just mush. It's due to him. It's him. It's mushed my brain. But um, yeah. Well, I think everyone's been talking about lookbooks recently and how 
and kind of it's all right then being online but sometimes it's nice to have something in your hand um good people to rely on for lookbooks is h&m if you sign up to h&m they you want to okay sorry we've got donut there you go oh i know it's such a hard life isn't it eating donuts all day um yeah, we talk about lip books and yeah, H and M is a good one. Um, I've also got their iPod app thing. It's not too bad. A lot of apps are coming out now. I think all the stores are doing them. Um, I think I think I've got River Island's one as well. It's quite good. But like you got you get an online uh, lip book on that. But yeah, um, Topshop as well. I'm loving the Topshop lip book. It's got. I don't know if you see there. Yeah, there's loads in it, loads of fashion, and oh, and it's also got the new makeup collection, Sandstore, and you've got Snake Valley, these are the trends at the moment, Graduate, and Swedish Summer. But yeah, so I love it, I always grab one of those. Also, ASOS as well. ASOS are awesome. It's not really a lookbook. Theirs is more a magazine. But I don't know. I love, I love like magazines like this. Um, I do buy magazines as well. But sometimes when you get obscure stuff online, um, a, a, there are a lot out there. There's a lot of online magazines as well. Um, their fashion shoots tend to be a lot more extreme and I don't know I just I love them I love I love books I love books Um I went to the library and I picked up got one don't know if it'll be any good you better be got you better be but um yeah I'm hoping it'll make my bangs look amazing <laughs> as he always says but yeah I mean the thing is you can always pick up a few tips from these books i also got a kids craft book um and it's got a recipe on how to make soap so i'm gonna put it up on the blog and give it a try i thought it'd be a great idea make my own soap get you making your own soap Woohoo! yeah cool anyway so yeah that was my rant for today but yeah i will try and do another video soon or if this is truly hideous and you can't bear to watch it then feel free to leave me a comment just saying just get off YouTube just just go anyway ciao for now